you run or have been thinking about starting an online coaching business, I'm gonna give you five websites that I use on a daily basis to stay productive and organized. And the best part is, they're all free. Now before I get started, I wanna say if you get some value from this video, then shoot me a DM on Instagram, give me a follow, and I'll give you access to a content marketing surprise. So let's get straight into it. Number one is Notion. When I first started my business, there was all this information coming at me from all angles. Obviously, I couldn't store it all in my brain, so I carried a notebook with me that I would write it all down in. I would also be writing notes in my iPhone notes, and then I'd even be screenshotting notes that would eventually get lost in my camera roll. Safe to say, I was not organized at all. I ended up having a chat with a mentor and he recommended a site called Notion. Notion is a productivity and note-taking application. It offers all sorts of organizational tools, such as task management, calendars, and much more. Now the way I have my notes set up is they're all in Notion under different folders, easy to find, and it just makes life easier. Website number two is Stripe. Stripe is an easy to use payment system. It's free to use, but they take a small percentage of each payment, but it is still better than PayPal or other payment softwares. You can set up recurring billing and even add your company logo to the invoices that you send out. Before I started using Stripe, I was using PayPal to take payments and there was just a lot of issues with it, with payments getting stuck and eventually never coming into my bank account. So Stripe is a must use. Number three is Asana or Asana. I've noticed that working with a team, if you have tasks building up, you can easily lose track and not be so organized. This may lead to you falling behind on work that you need to do. So it's important that you keep tasks organized for you and your team. So that's why I started using Asana. This is a free task management website where you can customize it to your liking. You can add team members, set due dates, and much more. I like it just because it's super easy to use and get the hang of, and I'm gonna continue to add more teammates onto there and keep using it. Number four is CapCut. Since I'm running an online business, it's important that I create content just like this to promote my business, but also get more eyes on my brand. And also so prospects can build trust with me, making them more willing to buy. But on social media nowadays, it's not enough to just speak your mind. You also need good quality edits. So that's why me and my team use Premiere Pro to edit all of our footage. But since that's not free, I wanted to give you another option. CapCut is a free video editing software that you can use on laptop or your phone. You can do everything you pretty much need, like add filters, sound effects, transitions, subtitles, and much more. It's a great free option for creating content for your online business. Number five is Metricool or Later.com. So we talked about the content creation process there, but when you have all that content piled up, you don't wanna be posting every single day. So what you can do is use Metricool or Later.com to schedule in those posts at the start of the month and they will get posted for you automatically throughout the month. So Metricool and Later.com allow you to schedule posts, they allow you to check your analytics and really just keep track of all your social media in one place. I also think it's handy to just see the analytics that they give you. I know for Metricool they give you kind of an end of week study for how you did and your best performing videos, things like that. So it really does help that way. And that's it, these are five free websites that I use on a daily basis to run my online business. Now if you did find this video any way helpful, then give it a like, subscribe, and comment down below. Let me know if there's any other good softwares out there that you'd recommend for productivity, organization, or overall just online business. Once again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.